Hey guys, Brandon with WhiskeyRiverTraining.com. So I'm here to talk to you about a couple handles that are super popular on our website and how they work along with the Axe Gang head. This is a Chinese made head by Cold Steel. And this comes in this finish and then also in uh, their competition drawer is silver. Uh, they have the same eye, so they fit the same handle. We don't make a handle that fits the bolt together type that they just came out with in the last uh, year and a half. Um, so this is super popular amongst throwers. It's a budget friendly head, budget friendly ax. However, there's not that many replacement handles available. We do not sell this head because we only sell American made products, but we do offer American made handles to fit in here. So these are Hickory. They are coated in a thin coat of lacquer we did that so that you can store them for years and not have them affected by humidity in venues. Uh, these are a lot of venues who use this as their ho house axe, so um, we're looking to have them have handles on, on hand ready to swap them out as they break. So it comes on a curved, curved or a straight handle, both 16 inches, and they're gauged in the eye to quick fit. Uh, most, most axe handles you have to use a draw knife and, and such. These ones are made to use very, very minimal uh, stock removal to get them to fit on the head. So you will have to use a knife or a sander a little bit to get that perfect fit, but they're a lot faster to hang. So all in the mindset of being able to switch them out fast and get them back in your lane and get back to throwing. So I'm gonna show you on this curved one here. So. This handle fits in really easily, and you can see here it's almost all the way in when you just slide it on there with really no pressure. So, a couple taps like that, take your hammer, and now you're flush at the top of the top of the head, and you can see down here it fits super tight, no gaps, and you've got a hung axe gang. Now, this is. This is a, a good idea to go ahead and trim off the shelf if there is one. So if there's any curling or anything like that, you want it to, the handle to taper into the head. That's why we've gauged it this way. So if, if you're at this step right now and it's curling, you want to take the head back off, gouge that away, sand that away, and then reset that handle because that's a prone breakage point is right there. And it'd be like cutting a two by four against the grain and then trying to break it, it would break right at that crease. So that's that's what we're having right here. This is obviously under a bunch of force when it's hitting the boards. So yeah, that is a good tip on how to hang them. So this each one comes with a wedge, a poplar wedge. We do offer exotic wedges on our website. There's uh, walnut, purple heart, mahogany, cherry, and white oak. However, each one of these comes standard with a poplar wedge. So trim the wedge to fit the eye. These are a little bit oversized, so you've got a little bit more material to work with. So you trim that to fit and then set it down and bang it in. So this is a pretty easy hang. I'd say, you know, you're looking at, once you get the old stump out of the, the eye, you're probably looking at four or five minutes to get these hung properly and then get back to throwing. So like I said, these come in a straight or a curved. We offer them in one, five and 20 packs. They sell out super fast when we do get them. There's a pile of venues that keep these in stock and also sell them to their uh, their guests. So when uh, if you're looking for these and they're sold out and you're watching this video, head over to our newsletter, which is at the bottom of our homepage. Otherwise, we'll put a link in the description. So on that note, a lot of people were have been asking us what quick draw is for our handles, uh, more information about how these handles fit and how easy they are to hang. So there it is. So check them out on the website, whiskeyrivertrading.com. Be good guys.